Alert Forecast. First day of summer, warm temperatures, sunshine, and a few scattered showers. Pretty much the perfect formula here for summer. We are looking at a few scattered showers moving on through right now. They're over Jefferson County, Madison County, and a few lightning strikes, 25 in the last 30 minutes, but that's all across southern Idaho. We're primarily picking up that lightning around the Caribou County area. That's since sort of moved off in the area we just talked about, and then into a little bit more southern Idaho into the west of us here. Taking a look at Henry's Lake, we did have some storm activity over Fremont County. This was looking north. So you saw those clouds kind of built up there and those wet roadways, but as you looked south, there was lots of sunshine. Taking a live look at our Farm Bureau cam over Pocatello, 80 degrees, winds at 9 miles an hour, a little bit cloudy there, but those temperatures right around average, maybe slightly above. So first day of summer, let's take a look across the entire west. We're seeing those triple digits into Las Vegas and Phoenix, as you might expect for late June. Comfortable into Denver, Great Falls in the sea in the 70s, as well as Seattle and Portland. But Boise, Pocatello, we're right about where we should be a little bit warm, but pretty good. On our Vipercast here, 10 p.m. tonight, we are going to hang on to a few of those scattered showers that we've seen this afternoon, mostly towards the upper highlands, spilling over into Montana and the highlands of western Wyoming. The rest of the region, things are looking good as we move overnight into tomorrow morning. We are looking for some clouds, maybe a slight pop-up shower into the central mountains. Throughout the rest of our Sunday, we're going to keep most of our shower activity to the high country, though we do have a chance of it spilling over, especially into the upper Snake River Plain. So this is 6 p.m. tomorrow afternoon, but we did see that green spread all across the Idaho-Wyoming border, Central Mountains, Lemhi County, and of course favoring into Montana. Now, that'll quickly move off for Sunday night, and we'll start out our work week on Monday pretty nice, and we'll actually stay that way for the first half of our week. We'll look for mostly sunny skies, mountain showers a possibility, but if you look at this 5 p.m., there's really nothing that's threatened the Snake River Plain, so we're going to look pretty good for the most part on Monday. Overnight tonight, 49 degrees for Chalice, 35 for Stanley. We're into those upper 40s, low 50s for most of the region, 50 degrees tonight for Rigby, 49 for Idaho Falls, 56 into Pocatello, 53 for American Falls. Those Overnight lows 56. I'm pretty sure that was our daytime high for one of our days last week, so we're starting to warm up a little here. 43 into Afton and western Wyoming seeing those 40s. For tomorrow's daytime highs, fairly similar to today. We're seeing those mid 70s for the high country, low 80s for the rest of the region, 80 into Lava, Aberdeen, Blackfoot, Idaho Falls, 75 for Rexburg, 68 into Island Park, and the Central Mountains will look for 70s across the board. Coming up the next eight days, we should keep our winds fairly light to start things off this week. We're talking the 5 to 15 mile an hour range, so something we're fairly used to. Temperatures into the 80s throughout the entire first half of the week. That might be a little warm, but as we head closer to the weekend, we'll drop back off into the upper 70s, lower 70s for Rexburg. We do have a slight chance of seeing some storms roll through Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Now that's only a 20% chance. So we are looking for just a pop up afternoon storm, and then it'll move its way on out, and we'll look pretty good for the rest of the day. Pocatello, mid 80s for the next several days, mostly sunny, especially Monday. Look for lots of sunshine. Overnight lows, mid to upper 50s throughout the week. Blackfoot at 80 for tomorrow, 49 the overnight low, 70s by the end of the week. We are looking for a windy Friday, but to start off our week, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, we're looking pretty good. Though to, or Sunday, we have that slight chance of seeing some storms. Jackson, look for a few off and on showers of possibility this week. Temperatures in the mid 70s, dropping down to the mid 60s later on. That feels good after that cool down we had this Yes, week. we were a little cooler to start yeah. things off this week, now 80s. It's almost a 30 degree swing from where we were. I love it. This is my favorite <laughs> I, I bet you do. Coming up, it may